gonna show you a couple of Easter art project today. Easter egg and the chick. These are great for younger children, like two year old or over. So you need a piece of paper, copy papers, any papers are great. Um, if you have construction papers, that's also great. If you have a large brushes, and for younger children, if you if they cannot use brushes, you can use cotton balls or wine cokes, anything like that. And washable paint. If you don't have paints at home, you can use markers, color pencils, anything you like. I listed all the materials below, so you can check out before you start. So let's start now with the copy paper. You can draw a large egg as big as a paper. You can also print out the egg shape if you don't want to draw. Um, I also listed the link below. Let's do some Easter colors first. A little bit of yellow. I got some colors and with the cotton ball. Let the kids to put a little bit of paint and then just tap, tap, tap inside of the egg. For younger kids, it's challenging or they don't even really care about the line but you can teach them put the paint inside make sure you cover and it's okay to put paint outside just let them have fun change the color let it dry so first one is for easter egg another one we're gonna paint a chick same thing with the shape drawing use yellow paint try to cover everything inside of the circle So if you don't have uh, cotton balls, you can use cold wine cokes. You can do the same thing. Or if you have brushes, you can use brushes. If you don't have paint, you can use markers or uh, pencils, crayons, anything you want. But the paint is always fun. So if you have a chance to get paint, I'll also put the link below where you can order if you cannot go outside. It's a challenge for them to keep paint inside of this line, but just teach them how to do it. If not, it's fine, but it's a good practice. So after you kind of see that's covered, you can use Q-tip black paint and orange paint. First, you put black on the Q-tip and then put two that One, two. Like eyes. And then another Q-tip. You can use orange. And do the little beak, like a triangle if you can. Older kids might be able to draw. If not, just any that orange. That's fine. That 
that's it for now and then let it dry again okay so once it's dry we're gonna cut this out that's why you can have paint outside of the line this will make it nice egg shape if your child have um, experiencing using scissors they can cut these lines that might be a good practice too if not the adults can help cutting like this and same thing with this one you can cut this out So if you have any colored paper or if you just have white paper, I forgot to mention you need glue, glue stick. You can just glue this onto this so you have a nice shape. If you have any colored papers, maybe see the green might be nice against yellow. You just put the glue on the back of this to glue with the glue sticks all over make sure you get the edge place this a little bit on top towards to the top And if you have still have the paint, the orange paint, you can make legs. You can draw legs like this. And that's it. Same thing with the egg, the glue on the back of this. Make sure you have enough glue. Easter egg on the paper. So this is the work. Easter egg on the chick. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the project. And um, I'll try to put more videos, so please subscribe. Thank you. Bye.